Where to go? Where to go? Kobo's finest watering hole. Maybe those anchorites aren't so bad after all. Didn't you call them weirdos? That was before Seer told me they're helping those poor refugees hide from the Empire. That right? Yeah. Working with the group called the Hidden Path. Real hush-hush stuff. So keep it in the family. Understood. It was nice to see everyone again. Yeah, it really was. So... Cordova thinks we'll find out how to cross the abyss by tracking down Dagon's old haunts? That's right. You ever been there? Once. Used to be a settlement. Now it's just a bunch of crumbling stone spires and creepy ruins. Get over here, kid. We're about to land. Master Cordova's research shows an abandoned settlement past the east side of the valley. Let's go check it out. Let's grab a lift, Beatty. Thanks for the help. Let's stop for a moment. Let's go. <laughs> Easy, Neko.
Why would we shoot him? We need to Thanks for the assist. Don't kill me! Kill you? I just saved your fool life. Who are you anyway? I'm Turgle. Well, if you won't keep breathing, you best follow me. This is Raider territory. Let's go. Hello? Hello? Someone help <clears throat> us. Excuse me! Would you be so kind as to dispatch this beast? We will make it worth your while. my frazzled associate is trying to communicate is that we would prefer not to die out here. <laughs> Well done! 
What a show! Come here, my warrior friend! I haven't seen such fighting since the championship. We are in your debt! What are you doing out here? We were out looking for the biggest, strongest beasts to fight each other! Winner take all! Within our Hollow Tactics game table, of course. Hollow Tactics, huh? That's right! And you have just helped us gather beastly data for our game. Just as soon as we find a place to set up shop, of course. My friend might be interested. He runs Pylune Saloon. Ah, yes. The saloon at Rambler's Reach. That dump? I didn't realize it was open. Well, tell you what. We're more than happy to bring Hollow Tactics to Pylunes. Good liven up the place. Let us make haste, Tully Moo. All things in their own time, Bima. You're out. Thanks for the ride. Welcome, welcome. Make yourself at home. Do you ever miss the glory days, Cal? The cut and thrust, the rough and tumble. That sounds like every day. Not that it's glorious. Well, I certainly had some glorious years. I'm sure I never told you about the incident over at Munilinst. Don't think you did. I was personally escorting a shipment of... Let's call it a sensitive luxury product. Unfortunately, we were costed by a customs longship. The fence had failed to update our transponder codes and our vessel was marked. Well, push comes to shove, and we were boarded. 
I've got three customs officers waving blasters under my nose, so what do I do? I throw on the waterworks. Oh, Cal, you cannot imagine. I'm swearing up and down about everything from past marriages to lower back pain. Almost worked, too. But one pesky officer decided to kick open a shipping container full of the slightly incriminating powder. Guess the jig was up. Oh, Cal. Cal, Cal. You're looking at a professional. I told them that they were looking at the ashes of a thousand ritually cremated Sereno war heroes. And by the stars, they bought it. The inspectors actually bought it. That, Cal, is why I'm here instead of rotting in a Munilinst work camp. Talk later, hmm? Oh, hey, it's you. I saw you tearing through the woods. Remember me? Name's Toa. I'm a historian. Freelance, these days. Cal, also freelance. You planning on doing more exploring? Of course. This is my first time beyond the mid-rim, but I can already tell this place is a trove. Centuries ago, folks couldn't wait to scratch out a living under a new sky. And hell, they sure chose a vibrant world. Vibrant, huh? Hey, let me know if you find any more of those chambers, yeah? Will do. Cal, I heard about a meditation chamber. You gonna check it out? Oh, I wish. It takes some serious acrobatics to access it, and... <laughs> I could give it a shot, Toa. A shot? This coming from the guy who scales basalt pillars in the time it takes me to date my field journal. Happy hunting, you two. Hey. So how'd you become a music producer? I was born on Riosa, in the Inner Rim. I've heard of it. Lots of heavy industry. Yeah, you couldn't escape the factories. So I used to make little tunes out of the noise from them in my head. You started early then. And never stopped. Hey there. Any ideas on what to play, BD? I know you like this one, buddy. Do you think your quest, Ash? You can try. Great. Uh, do you know about Anselmi throat intonation? Oh, deep cut. Aren't those only performed underwater? Exactly. Let's go for this track. Low frequency band is a carryaway for deep sea telemetry. Can you imagine? We could try to decode it in atmosphere. I'm gonna be straight with you, Toa. Folks here are not gonna appreciate that. How about this? Uh, but hit me up if you have other suggestions, yeah? Great, yeah, I uh, hit you up. How about this one? Let's change the tempo. Let's hear it. The great works, the beacon, and Kobo was right in the middle of it. This world is a window into a golden age. So what'd you do before you came here? I used to perform in a medicine show. I was required to dress in garish outfits and read fortunes while others would scam the audience. That sounds a little demeaning. Yes. But the experiences we carry always have a use, Sojourner. When I arrived on Kobo, I noticed a charlatan trying to swindle someone with fool's priorite. How'd you know? He wore long sleeves in the heat. Sleight of hand, huh? I saw a merchant on Karelia do that. An old trick. Well, I stopped the sale. And Doma has been grateful ever since. And the swindler? Tried the trick on the Raiders, so I hear, and sealed his fate. Sojourner, you smell of smoke and sand. I should take another shower then. 
Talk to you later, Two Locked. Go back. Perceptive. Also not as dumb as I first thought. Thanks. Go on now. I'm busy. You ever leave this booth? Thinking about it. Wouldn't hold your breath, though. Busy, Barkeep. busy. You look tired. Take a load off. Ever pick up any good tips from bartending? For starters, every client has a tell. What's my tell? Well, if I told you, it wouldn't be a tell. Ah, fine. So what's your tell? My incurable honesty. Hey, sport. Can't chat now. Keeping an eye on those two treasure hunters who just showed up. Remember to relax every now and then, will you? Too much tension in the coils is bad for the joints, if you catch my drift. See you later, Monk. Private table. All right, then. Whoa, easy, Grok. Sorry about my friend here. He's just a little guarded. Yeah, I get it. Name's Dana. You might say my partner and I have a talent for turning opportunity into profit. I'm Cal. This is BD. Noisy little thing. We're thinking of heading to Dredger Gorge. Ever been? Once or twice. I'd be careful out there. That's gang turf. Gang turf? Grok! I'm sure it ain't that bad. The hell I'm risking my neck on gang turf. <laughs> hey, it was great meeting you, Cal. Got some business to discuss with my old pal here. <laughs> Come on, BD. See you when I see you. So how'd you two meet anyway? I all started with this Merc crew I joined. Brock had been recruited a few months earlier. On account of my good looks. That's right. Mm, and me on account of being the smoothest thing since Hut Blubber. Anyways, things were good until our outfit tried to pull one over on the Empire. So we... We took off and started our own thing. The rest of the outfit ended up dead or imprisoned. What the car, Brock? I was telling it. Kid doesn't need our whole life story. Uh-uh. Point is, Brock and I realized that we're better off just the two of us. We know the feeling. Come back later, yeah? Hey, got a sec? Watch yourself around the stone spires, Cal. What'd you hear? Apparently the Raider base isn't too far from there. Thanks for the warning. When Kobo's moon was shattered, the Republic settlement collapsed, leaving those spires. That place isn't just an old ruin. It's a tomb. Don't forget about that shattered moon. Cordova seems to think it was important. Good call. Might just be Grease's stew talking, but this place is beginning to grow on me. The Bedlam Raiders have been awfully quiet, striking up much less trouble than usual. That's a good news. And the bad news? Rumor has it they're lining up behind a new leader. Know anything about that? Dagon Gera. Ravis serves them. Huh. Figures. Cubba just can't catch a break. Watch yourself out there. You do the same, Mosey. Know anything about the High Republic residences on Kobo? Oh, when I first got here, I did a little exploring of my own. I went into a place, and then I heard creepy voices, and I got out of there in a hurry. I'll let you know if I hear any voices, Grease. Wise guys. Not now, Cal. I'm pretty sure Monk reorganized my entire spice rack. But I don't know exactly what he changed. But I don't hate it.
Hey, Scuba. How's the water? Ah, fine. I just wanted to thank you for lending me your tank. Plenty more space for plenty more fishes, though. Let's keep them all spinning, eh? You too, Z. Should you find any data discs from my day, I'd be happy to decrypt them for you. I imagine there are many that remain lost on Kobo. We'll let you know if we do. Oh, Cal, it's delightful to see you fully intact. Holding up okay? Fine, thanks. It's not the first time this frontier has been terrorized by marauders, you know. But once more, the noble Jedi Knights rise to the occasion. I appreciate the thought, Zeke, but we should watch the whole noble knight stuff. Yes, uh, of course. Good luck tracking down those leads, and please, do let me know if you find anything. Stay safe, and keep an eye out for more raiders. Oh, I will. May the Force be with you, Cal. Hey, Zig. What's going on? Enjoying the view. Not often we get this much of a crowd at Pylons. Uh, let's chat later. Cal, I've got a question for an accomplished warrior like yourself. Say your enemies are closing in fast, with blasters drawn and murder in their eyes. Uh, okay. What do you do? I focus on the moment and trust my training. Overthinking what will happen can make you freeze up. Yeah, that makes sense. But the most important thing is to know what you're fighting for. My life? Well, that's a start. I wish I could be a fearless warrior like you, but I can't, so I'm glad you're around. Welcome, welcome! Why not step up and try your Ah, our savior returns. Let me make a proper introduction. I am Bima Ook, and this is my associate, Talimu. As you can see, we have set up a game of Hollow Tactics here in Pailoon Saloon. I'm Kel. Glad you made it back safe. I'd say the same to you, but it seems there is no doubt that you can handle yourself. I see you have a companion droid. They can add to your Hollow Tactics deck by scanning combatants. Ah, got it. The more scans BD collects, the more options I'll have in the game. Exactly. Of course, there is nothing stopping you from playing right now. Ready for a game of skill? It's a recording? When do I start talking?
tactics. Now that's a hollow kill. And Cal takes one out. Oh, it never stood a chance. That's the round to Cal Kestis. Looking good for Cal! Cal Kestis takes the match! Oh no, my high score! So, you think you can take on old Grease? There's no actual credits involved. So, you think you can take on old Grease? What a show.
the board! A well-played round by Cal Kestis! Love to see it! So, you think you can take on old Greece? This 
will be a true contest of minds. Perhaps a new stratagem is required. I foresaw this victory. This will be a true contest of minds. It appears your strategy wasn't up to the challenge. 